men are really wicked. No wonder the Bible says the heart of a man is desperately wicked. These days, people are more consigned for your money, for what they can get from you, not what they can give you. They can do anything for money. People are becoming very callous, heartless. The worst part of it, where are we going with this money? I saw this video from Untouchable Comedies. He pranked his boys. His boys he picked from nowhere to be where they are today. He picked them to establish them. Some, he's even, you know, in charge of their education, looking for a way to help them. Put them in his own house. Some of them are even wearing his own clothes. But on this particular day, he decided to prank them. To really know who he is. Who. And he came to tell them, oh, I have heart problem. The doctor said my heart is bad and I need a transplant. And I need about 500 and something million to be able to, to get it done. And I have to travel out of the country. And I don't have up to that. So the doctors have given me one month to go, one month to leave. So I have started sharing my properties to my family members. And I have come to you as my boys to know what, can, what, that is, what do you want me to give to you? What do you want from me? At first, they appear as if they are consigned. Then before you know it, they started showing their true colors. One said, why will you leave us here as you are sharing properties to your family members? You should know that we are your boys. We live together. You should have considered out first. Seriously? Are you for real? He was even angry. You can see it from his reaction. Why did you leave us here? You are sharing your properties there. You should have considered our first. Then he asked him, what do you want from me? One said, I need 10 million to continue from where you stop. One said, I need 5 million to finish my school. Another one said, you know I'm the one taking care of your pages, your social media accounts. So, I don't need much. I'm the one in charge of your TikTok. I'm the one in charge of your Facebook page, your YouTube, your Instagram. So all I need, just leave them for me. Those I can't leave it for me. That one will be very okay for me. Are you for real? Do you know how much money Untouchable is getting from those accounts? Every month millions of naira millions that is cashing out from those accounts just because you have been the one in charge you know what is coming from those accounts that means why you have been taking care of the account your eyes have been on the money that is coming out from there so you want to continue with it it took only one it was the turn of that one and he came and he knelt down. He knelt down close to untouchable. He was crying. He said, I don't want you to die. I don't want anything to happen to you. I believe God can do something. Why do you accept this? And untouchable shouted on him and said, tell me what you want. He said, I don't want anything from you. I don't want anything from you. I want you to be fine. Let me take you to my pastor. Among the six of them, it was only this one that was having a clean heart towards him. And at the end, Untouchable made them to know he, he pranked them. It was a prank. And they were all crying. It was only the one that was praying for him. Instantly, he gave him five million. Say, you are a good friend. You are a good brother. He gave him five million. 
while the rest were driven out. The first person, he was nice. He told to pack out of his house. Was the one that said, I want to be in charge of your page. Leave it for me, your account. They all failed the test. And sometimes, this parking is good though. For you to really know who is who. Sometimes people laugh with you. But if you can open their heart, you see that their heart is very dirty. Very dirty against you. Ah, money, money, money. Nobody ever leave this world with money. Let's live well. Let's have one another in heart. The Bible says love one another. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Please. I'm not telling you not to do good. Do good though. It's good to do good. But this pranking is good. God bless you for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.